University of Washington Medicine, we are the premier healthcare provider in the Pacific Northwest. We embrace the innovation and we try to work as a well-oiled machine to take every aspect of a patient's needs into consideration. The Digestive Health Institute is just one example of how the University of Washington operates. And, and that example is the creation of a nucleus of people, each one with different types of expertise. We bring together not only gastroenterologists and surgeons, but also pathologists. Physicians from specialties including radiology, medical and radiation oncology, pharmacy, social work, and nutrition. Even disciplines that um, are, one may think, peripheral, like pulmonologists and otolaryngologists. And by gathering these people together and simultaneously assessing a patient at a single visit, we're able to then provide the care that's specifically designed to optimize their health. All right, how is, how's everything going after surgery? I tell my patients that when I present their case at our tumor board, they instantaneously get a second, third, and fourth opinion from doctors from different specialties. They get a recommendation that's unbiased and represents the collective. The Center for Esophageal and Gastric Surgery has been phenomenal, really, in taking care of me. I had a, a medical condition called Barrett's esophagus that was first diagnosed about 35, 40 years ago. In 2012, December of 2012, it was diagnosed as a cancerous condition. And uh, subsequently, I went through radiation and chemotherapy, and then finally had surgery and had the esophagus removed. Esophagectomies are one of the most complex operations surgeons perform around the world. And for that reason, it's important to do a very high volume of cases to maintain proficiency in um, the care of patients, uh, but also to optimize the outcomes. The doctors are, have wonderful experience. Uh, they seem to have just a real innate sense of, of what I was needing. They were concerned about my well-being. The patient's needs are the only driver of what tests the patient is going to have, what treatments are going to be offered to the patient, independent of the providers. So we bring together our expertise to give the patient the absolute personalized treatment that the patient needs. Here at the University of Washington, we've been focused on making uh, surgery and invasive procedures as minimally invasive as, as possible. We brought this to the region over 20 years ago. We did so for benign conditions of the esophagus and stomach, and we quickly apply that to uh, malignancies of the esophagus and stomach. The Digestive Health Institute at the University of Washington performs virtually every form of endo endoscopic technique uh, that uh, is available. We do simple procedures such as endoscopy, and we also do advanced procedures such as endoscopic mucosal resection, endoscopic submucosal dissection, interventional endoscopic ultrasound, uh, as well as mucosal ablation techniques such as radiofrequency ablation and cryoablation. We have incorporated research into the Digestive Health Institute. Our biomedical research is among the best in the country. One of the exciting aspects is our ability to take what we learn at the bench and immediately put it into practice. The research arm at the Digestive Health Institute is a comprehensive research program that involves clinical, basic, and translational research really focused on gastrointestinal diseases and um, with a primary focus on gastrointestinal cancer. One of the major ways we are contributing is the development of large patient cohorts of patients with clinical information not otherwise available in medical records, coupled with biological samples, and linked to clinical outcomes through electronic health records. We've been able to develop cohorts for inflammatory bowel disease, chronic liver disease, Barrett's esophagus, and a variety of GI and liver cancers. In this way, we hope to advance knowledge and eventually improve health of all patients with gastrointestinal and liver disease. We're very well positioned to collaborate with investigators around the country and around the world to understand these diseases better, to find new ways to diagnose them and novel ways of treating these diseases. I'm extremely proud 
uh, to be a part of uh, the Digestive Health Institute at the University of Washington. A lot of people talk about having teams and uh, being integrated, but at the University of Washington, we have really invested uh, in, in those teams. We have created space for providers to come together. I feel that this collaboration is something unique to the University of Washington. There is no other greater call that I can think of than that of attending to another human being's personal needs.